We are approaching a long weekend for a lot of you and traditionally many people head out of town. But before you do, is your home protected? Joining me now with some important safety tips this Memorial Day weekend is Officer Nick Comas with the Roanoke Police Department. Welcome. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning. Yeah, I'm glad that you're here. Thank you. These are important reminders for people as they head out of town. Mm -hmm. uh, number one, don't post it to Facebook or social media that you're leaving. Yes, please don't. <laughs> Unfortunately, you know, we, we do find that some criminals choose to utilize social media do in they? some of their attempts. So sure. we ask people to just to lay off social media for a little bit until they can return. Yeah, when you return, it's okay to post your pictures. And yes, ma'am. You had a great vacation, but not the minute you're leaving. That is correct. Okay, Definitely. now if you leave for an extended amount of time, consider having a trusted neighbor or a friend pick up the mail, maybe take care of your trash, that kind of thing. Absolutely, yes ma'am. We see that and we often find that if, if you do have some activity in your house, sometimes that activity can be used as a deterrent for criminal activity. Okay. So yes ma'am. If you don't have a friend or whatever, then maybe stop the mail. Uh, call, the, call the post office, have the mail stop, yes ma'am, and that way, you know, the newspapers and your mail doesn't pile up pile in front up. of your house. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. Okay, and then leave some lights on. You recommend Yes, ma'am. If you do choose to leave some lights on, understanding that power bills can get expensive, we just ask that maybe you put the lights on some type of time and device. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then don't leave the spare keys out. <laughs> we do find that people lay these huge rocks with keys underneath them in front of, that <laughs> front, uh, in front of their front yards, and sometimes that's just a big arrow saying that we have a key hidden. So, yeah, we'd ask that you please just take all scare, spare keys. And if you want to leave a spare key, leave it with a trusted friend or neighbor. Right, exactly, mm -hmm. yeah, because it may seem like, you know, it's hidden to you, but you know what, I think that the criminals have seen this Yes, ma'am, they have seen that before. <laughs> all right, and then stay in touch with your neighbors while you're gone. Why is that important? Yes, ma'am. Uh, you know, sometimes you just like to have that reassurance that your that your belongings, your residences remain secured. If you have a close friend, trusted neighbor that you can keep an eye on for your house, sometimes that call back will make your vacation go just a little bit better knowing that your house is, is remains okay. secured. Yes, right, exactly. All right, this is interesting. Don't lead burglars to your home with your GPS. So say you're parked at the airport mm -hmm. in, and you have your GPS plugged and you can put in home. That's a very, <laughs> very good and valid point. Yes, ma'am. I never even thought about this. Absolutely, you can turn on your GPS. Most GPSs don't have a passcode, so anybody can turn them on. A lot of people do save their homes as a home address. Mm -hmm. I can just hit home, and hey, if your car's not there, chances are you might not be, so that hopefully we'll avoid that. Yeah, okay. Um, if you do have valuables in your home, you may want to consider putting them in a safe, Yes, right? ma'am. Anytime you're away, both in your vehicle or your car, we ask that you secure all your valuables. Okay, and then have a plan, right? Yes, ma'am, absolutely have a plan. Wherever you go, whether you go to Smith Mountain Lake or you travel locally or, or you go long distance, have a plan and have a contingency plan after that. If my car breaks down, what am I gonna do? Who's gonna look out for my house? Mm -hmm. Or all my, did I bring my cell phone charger? Yeah. Stuff of that, of that nature. Do you recommend, okay, so I, I live in the city and if I go away on vacation, can I call the police department and say, hey, I'm gonna be out of town, will you just take a look yes, every once in a while? Will you do Any, that? Yes, ma'am, absolutely. Any citizen in the, in the Roanoke City area can call 853-2212 mm -hmm. and request extra patrol while you're gone for your vacation. Oh, nice. Yes, ma'am, right. absolutely. Well, thank you so much for the tips. Yes, ma'am, absolutely.